Hi, I'm Cher Smith and I'm the manager for Swin and Food Collective. I've been here for seven years now and in that time I've seen our numbers grow from just about 3,000 to well over 10,000 now heading towards 11. We're at our main distribution centre here at Wesley and out of here we send out 122 tonnes of food to help these people in need. So let me tell you about how the food is processed once it's donated. So anybody's donations come in through the warehouse and they're weighed in. Um, they are then sorted by best before dates into products and into their years. They are then stored within that date regime. Then we have a pick list where our volunteers go around the warehouse, pick them in the shopping order list um, and pack them into our boxes and then they go out to the distribution centres from here. The situation now is becoming quite dire. This is all the fruit that we have um, and that will be probably be gone by the end of this week and the tomatoes and soups we have empty empty shelves which is unheard of so to help fill our empty boxes we're going to need donations of tomatoes soup um, potatoes tinned meat tinned meals um, vegetables um, fruit and puddings definitely um, and then again toiletries household things washing up liquid laundry pods um, two-in-one shampoo would be perfect.